Yo, what's going on, Sexy Samlander Squad? I thought I would start here so I could show you guys what I'm doing. Ability 1, L. Ability 2, O. Ability 3, P. E. Ability 4, whatever that is. Um, yeah, no abilities. It's dual, but I can only auto attack. Now, I know technically Medusa's one is just an auto attack enhancer, right? So like, kind of weird in the sense where, uh, where like you click the button and all it really does is enhance your autos. And I could see how that could be an issue. And some people would think that that would be allowed. Unfortunately, I don't think it would be allowed. And I will be leveling abilities just because I don't want to stare at the blinking the whole time. Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't know how this is going to go. Honestly, I, I'm a little skeptical. You're going to destroy me two times in a row. Please make one a video. Oh, buddy. They're both going to be videos. <laughs> And I don't know, dude. I, I I don't know if I'll I'll hit you with the Destroyotron in this game. I'm a little skeptical. Now, thankfully, Mannequins makes buffing still pretty good. The issue is that he's gonna outclear me so hard. I will get an Obo this game. Um, I will get an Obo for sure. That will help with clear. I'll get a silver branch. I'll get max attack speed. And I'll get all the I'll get all the things that are like good and important and whatnot. Alright. We did pretty good damage to him there. I use my beads just because I wanna get some pressure going on him. So that he can't um He doesn't feel too comfortable pushing waves too hard because obviously he could out push my wave easily. I want to go itch of all first item because that's going to be huge damage. Need two autos on the minis to kill them. Uh, I wonder if he went to my speed. He definitely should have, but I don't know if he did. Might get a frost on this game. Might be something I could look into. How much is this 1800 the early game i think is going to be the hardest part like once i have itch of all which i have oboe once i have um you know all these other things all these other items that i plan on getting once i have those it'll be fine <clears throat> it's just getting to that point is going to be very difficult All right, I'm going to stay. I'm going to be a little greedy on this wave because I kind of need to be. Oh, I'm actually really happy he hit me with that instead of the wave. Because the more time I have hitting this wave, the better. I mean, you're quite literally never going to kill me here, so. Keep in mind, by the way in mind that doing this challenge does completely eliminate my option to use my ult as CC immunity. Alright, through the wave, I gotta get a Javal. Alright. Itchval is going to help a lot. I go from 0 power to 80 power. And, you know, much faster attack speed, obviously. And lowering his attack speed, too. He didn't do this red, did he? Oh, no. It's still not up. That's why. Mm. 
Hmm. In defense right now. Running that way. I'm never going to out secure. Like I could sneak the buff maybe, but I will never out secure the buff. So if he's there, obviously he's going to get the buff. He's not there. Okay. You know, I'm actually not behind in XP or gold yet. All right. Did good damage there. I think it's even better. That damage I did is even better than what it looks like because it out pressures him and maybe gives me his red buff. Uh, mannequins. Nice. I don't think he can kill me here. Interval is too strong. And he doesn't have enough mana either. Alright, he's gonna back. I'm gonna go do your speed buff. I wanna back with 2100 gold because I immediately want the oboe. I think oboe is gonna help so much. I would love getting Oboe, dude. Okay, we're gonna get this wave. And maybe my speed buff. And then we can get Oboe. I need to not use my beads aggressively like I have been doing. Because it sets up a very easy kill for him. I mean, I don't think he knows yet. That I can't use abilities. Because I haven't really been fighting him much. I've just been like randomly beadsing his stunts. I get Oboe. And I'm gonna get Aegis too. Your middle tower is under attack. Probably lose tower here. <laughs> As expected. Frostbound would actually be super nice. I would quite like a Frostbound. Oh, yeah. Obo is so nice. Alright, there's his ult. Um... I actually think my next item might be Frostbound. Nice. Huge kill, huge kill, huge kill. Um, should it be a Frostbound? I won't even do enough damage to warrant it, will I? Like, I won't scare him enough. I think I just go Aussie. I think we go Aussie and I want, um, I need a Cairns, I need Aussie, XE, Frostbound, I need Silver Branch. Mannequins is just for the early game. I don't need that for later. Obviously upgrading Mannequins to Mannequin Mace wouldn't be terrible. But I'm going to push this tower down. It gives me a lot of freedom if I can do it. Getting this tower down. It might sacrifice my red buff, but it is what it is. Yeah. yeah. I kind of figured that's exactly what would happen. 
I sacked my red buff to get the tower. <laughs> I'm okay with that, actually. I got a little bit of time in that red buff to spawn. I don't have any CC immunity, so if he's uh he's coming at me, I gotta be careful here. Um can I get this in time is the question. The answer was yes. All right, cool. So we'll grab the Aussie. Which I think is actually huge. Kind of gigantic. Um, this is a very close game. Like, I know I'm ahead in gold and I'm ahead in XP and stuff, but like... You got to understand, it's not just golden XP that wins games, right? Like, there's so much into his kit that he's that, that he can use that um that I just can't do anything about, you know. And he thinks the same for me, probably. But I, I I'm almost certain at this point he knows. Like, there's no way you can not know. Okay, that's all of his relics. Thank you, Aussie. Um, I do have enhanced red. So if he does back here, I might be able to do something. Nah, he'll be back too quick. I get like one or two autos on the Phoenix. Oh, I'm so dead. Go, dude. Big kill. Big kill, baby. And that is Phoenix down. All right. Let's go, dude. That's huge. What's my next item, though? Um. Will definitely be more attack speed. XE might be XE. I was gonna sell mannequin, but it's it's not worth selling mannequin just yet. Not just yet. I mean, XE is good. I'm wondering if I should go Xe or Kins here. It's like I know Kins is good too. Oh, he's getting it. That's annoying. See if I had Frost on here. I guess we got everything from him now. Do I want... Do I want, man? Do I want XE? Do I want Kings? Do I just want to go Frostbound? I feel like I really want Frostbound. Like, really, really bad. Mm. 
If I had Frostbound right here, he's dead. A thousand percent. Okay, Polly. Ow. I don't want to let him back, by the way. He probably really wants to back. I'm going to cut him off this way. Darn. Darn. I do so many stuns there. That poly hits hard. Um. And I don't know. Is Frost worth it? I kill him so many times. That, like, in that fight, I would kill him with Frostbound. And then in the one fight by my tower, I would have killed him with Frostbound. But that's only two fights. I guess we've only had three fights, right? So maybe if it if it wins two out of three fights this game, then it's definitely worth it, right? Like that's just how it works. All right, we should definitely be able to get this tower again. Surprised actually. I'm really surprised he didn't alt that. Yep, you alt. Okay, I hate my life. That was super awkward. That was super awkward. Almost lost the game. There we go, dude. There's a victory using only auto attacks. Victory with only auto attacks. GG Gamer. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And, um... Until next time, peace.